And welcome back to more Destiny 2 Forsaken. Uh, I'm Porcupine, and this is two other Porcupines. <laughs> yeah, so last we left off, we just defeated, um, can't remember, uh, the Machinists. So uh, from the mission marker, we say, uh, uh, we've been told that we need to return to Petra uh, to find out more tips about where the next and the final Baron will be, and then is Prince Aldrin. But before uh, before we continue, I should probably let you know that um, I've played a little bit on my own, uh, so not for long. So I'm now at 475, just trying to slowly increase all the stuff. Uh, I have also increased the sleeper, which is now at 485. Now, I'm going to guess that the next mission will be around 470, 480. So I think this is about the right level to tackle this. Uh, if not, then I'll see how it goes. But yeah, let's do this. After the war, everyone in the reef mourned our queen and our prince, except me. I didn't believe they had died. I couldn't. But then, Aldrin returned. He told me he could hear the Queen's voice in his head. That's when I knew he was changed. I could have prevented all of this. But instead, I hid him away in the prison of elders. And now, Cade is dead. The reef is in ruins. And I've confirmed that Aldrin is on his way to the Watchtower. It's now or never. Oh, okay, so, um, apologies. <clears throat> okay, let's make this clear. So Aldrin's plan is revealed for some magical reasons. Uh, Petra has found out that he'll be at the Traveler's Shard. <laughs> and failed a sniper shot on some object that is arguably not moving. So, well done, Petra. Uh, so, I'm guessing Aldrin is, what, trying to revive his sister? Or is it... What was it? She wants him to force open the door to the Dreaming City, a fabled Awoken stronghold, whatever that is. Uh, by completing... Okay, so the next thing we need to do is nothing left to say. That's the that's the name of the mission, but um, it does sound a bit like it's the final mission. <clears throat> so let us find out, shall we? Return to you? What? Oh, we need to talk to Spider again. Okay. So that royal runt, Aldrin, wants into the Watchtower. I always wondered what. Secrets and treasures the Awoken stashed in that airsat spire. But my friendship with Queen Mara while she lived stayed my hand. Well, that and a locked door. Thus, I am honor bound to send a selection of my finest to help you find that ever elusive closure. I must say, I cannot wait to see how this ends. Okay, so the spider is also interested in know what's behind the, uh, uh, presumably within the watchtower, or uh, it's. I get a feeling that it's going to be the dreaming city. Uh, so, but I'm also quite curious to know whose ghost he's holding. Um, maybe the maybe they already mentioned it at some point, but I just can't remember them saying that there's a, a as in I I didn't catch whose ghost it is. I don't think he actually mentioned it, but you know. Anyway, so I just realised that there's actually a little cupboard here, with an inspect. Whoa, dead ghost, my friend. Did you see that? That was a dead ghost. Interesting. Okay, let's have a look. So now we need to avenge Kate Six. Okay, so this really is the final mission. Let me have a look at the watchtower. So the mission marker is saying recommend the power 460. Do you want to do this, guys? Do you want to do this, guys? I think we should. Let's do this. I really want the Ace of Spades. The Ace of Spades uh, was my favorite hand cannon in D1. Now, I, I already said this a few times, 
I don't think I'm great at using hand cannon, and I will happily admit that I suck at using hand cannons, but that was the first hand cannon where I thought, you know what, this is really fun to use. So that has, that's always been the case, and then that's when I actually got even more into trying to practice using hand cannons and stuff. Um, what am I doing? We're not there yet. Hmm. <clears throat> So yeah, I remember just using that hand cannon and, and playing as a hunter doing patrols in D1 whenever I feel like I just want to kill some time and I, I would just whip that hand cannon out, equip it because, um, because I was so bad at using hand cannons. It felt like that um, it grew with me. As a, it, It's just one of those things that will remind me by just simply holding it, it will remind me of the good times. So I'm super excited to know that it's coming back to D2 and the fact that it's attached to such an epic storyline. It's even better. This is as far as you go. Please, for you I go instead. Oh no, darkness lives here. Death, you are not of ether, can't bring you back. All the same. Yes, father, we ever serve and await return. Go, inspire, and avenge your murdered friends. There's no more room for fear, dear brother. I'm not afraid. Of course not. You have sacrificed like no other. You looked into an abyss, bowed to false kings, and suffered uncountable betrayals. You were humiliated, imprisoned, manipulated, taken, and still you gave up everything because you Please, brother, will you walk through hell for me one last time? Yes. Good. Then let us finish this. Even paradise is a prison when you can't leave. Okay, so I don't quite understand what he's trying to do by going through to, well, getting into the Watchtower. You know what's down there. The Watchtower. The Fanatic. Aldrin. The End. Justice or revenge. Aldrin deserves what's coming to him. But, Guardian, the why of what we're doing is as important as the what. 
I don't know what you're thinking, but remember that. All right, this is it. Nothing left to say. Approaching by air. Honestly, no idea what to expect. But this looks like a full-on war here. There's a spider tank next to me. A bunch of hedgehogs. Or porcupines. Do they look a little bit more like porcupine? I think they look more like porcupine. If you don't know what the difference is, porcupine actually has like a... Uh, like really long spikes. Oh, I can't see anything. Hedgehog on the other hand is more like a... Um, it's more like a fur or, or fur of spikes, whereas porcupine has like extremely long spikes. I think that's what, what the difference is anyway. I could have mixed it all the other way around, but I'm pretty sure that it is. Because I remember every time I say, I had to explain to some people saying that why my name is called Porcupine <laughs> and uh, on PSN. And they just say, oh, is it like a hedgehog? And I have to look it up. It's, no, it's not as cute as a hedgehog. I wish it was a, as cute as a hedgehog, but it isn't. Okay, so this actually does feel like a full-on warfare. Oh, crap. So let's help out these guys. Ah, I flinched. Oh, this is annoying. One down, two down. The shield guy. There we go. No, I think that's it. Yeah, those are just like uh, randoms. Let me just take a moment, just uh, have a double check on this chest armor, because, yeah, 489, let's go, baby. I think anything that I can use to boost my level up, boost my light level up, would be good, just, uh, just to get that additional defense. Because I know that the recommended power, I'm well above the recommended power now by, like, 7, what was it, 407? 407 I've got, so the recommend power is 460, so that means I'm about 15, maybe? Was it 15? Oh, 417, 17, okay. So, but still, you kind of in a one versus many situation. You really don't want to take your chances. It's not, um, especially in, like, the boss fight, uh, in most... In most Destiny boss fights, you're one versus many. You very rarely get the luxury of doing 1v1. Okay, hello there. I suck at using this. Ooh. Hey there. Yeah, they're called Ravager. So, yeah, I got a grenade as well. In case you, in case I didn't get all of you, the smoke grenades I do I do think needs a little bit of buffing in PVE just because they don't last that long. Oh, something interesting over there. I wonder what it is. Look at this. This is the watchtower. It looks pretty cool, actually. You enjoyed killing them. Damn right. Come out here. Oh, there we go. There is the one versus many I was talking about. Jesus, how many are there? I'm really glad I'm using Orpheus Rig now. Alright, let's make sure all these uh, long distance guys are out of the way. 
good stuff. What the? Tether. I can do this. One last shot. Got it. The scorn on forever. We did it. Only one name left. Aldrin Sov. It's time to end this. For Cade. Okay, this is going to sound really bad, and it's a really bad joke, I can see it coming, but whenever he says scones, I just keep on thinking scones, as in like the British bakery food delicacy. <laughs> the scones are forever. <laughs> Guardian, no one has stood where you are since the Queen closed these doors. Yours are the first outsider eyes to ever see this place. Not had a scone for ages. Looking good. I mean, this looks like... It doesn't look like something Awoken will build because we've never really seen what the Awoken culture is like. Uh, in D1, they occupied a reef and the reef was like um, a home of the fallen almost. It was like dark, dingy. But if this was really like the Awoken kind of uh, architecture, this is completely brand new. It's almost elf-like. I like it. Anyway, inspect. This is a communication device, but the coordinates it's broadcasting to shouldn't exist. Okay, so uh, there are some laws around as I was just wondering whether there's anything that I could actually, you know, get, but I don't think there is, so let's just move on. Remember guys, I'm, uh, as much as possible I want to experience the game like the way it is so if there's like hidden like hidden stories like behind these rubbles and you just have to kind of hop and inspect it to get like another dialogue going, I will happily do that. I just don't want to rush the game. Keep moving. I'll get to you as fast as I can. Hmm. Oh, is this it? Is this where we part we part ways with reality. Ascendant plane. It sounds more like something the hive would do. Look at this. Okay, so where are we exactly? It looks like looks like some sort of uh, a giant bore pool is what it is, or bore pit. Open the door, brother. Open the door. I can't. No. Dang, it's creepy as hell. <clears throat> okay, I'm getting a feeling that this is it, so... Forcade! Uh, I wish there was like a weapon of choice that we can go for that would represent Cade, but it doesn't feel like we have anything, so what do you say that we will rock him with the gunslinger and we'll try to kill Aldrin with the gunslinger shot? Yeah, let's do that. That sounds fun. Oh, hang on a second. What? Oh, excuse me, Blade Barrage, I see. Okay, so it's just kind of unlocked after you unlock the first new subclass super, so for the others, you, it would just automatically unlock. I'm going to go Gunslinger, and I think I'll go for a Hand Cannon, um, maybe, just for the fun of it. Because Kate was using a hand cannon. That's the only hand cannon I have here that's kind of above the power level, at the power level I want. So, yeah, let's let's do this. Let's use a hand cannon and a sniper rifle. Rocking as a gunslinger. Ooh. 
Where are we? The line between dimensional planes is thin here. Oh, this looks like it, guys. This looks very much like it. Oh, what the heck? What the heck, guys? Are you serious? Right. Alright, this is testing my skills as a as a one free mini player. So here we go. Make Kate proud. I need to use a blue hand cannon to do all this. It will make it will make the, getting the ace of spades all the more sweet. Holy huge! <laughs> Dang it, no. Flinching way too much to use any of these things. I need to uh I need to regroup for a little bit. Okay, that's uh some down. Eesh. Yeah, this guy's tough. Sleeper time. Ah, I flinched. I just saw the. Uh, I just saw the sniper on on the uh, right hand corner, and then I panicked. Okay, so far. So good. This hand cannon's actually alright with Outlaw. I like it. This is the pr this is the great th thing with random rolls. It's like it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what it is because um, if it does if it has a great roll, it doesn't matter what class it is. Got it. Ooh, that was tough. But we made it. Okay, pursue Aldrin. So before we do, though, let's just make sure we uh, just make sure we are set because we did change the subclass and I had to get used to it. Let me double check that I'm not using anything stupid. Okay, yeah, this is more usable marksman dodge. So I'm trying to mimic as much as possible Kate Six's loadout. Trip mine grenade, uh, all the good stuff. We don't really need um, kinetic blues because we've got we've already got something that's five oh five above five hundred, so it doesn't really matter. It's the others, so it should be all right now. I've got boots that are four eighty. What do you say, guys? Should we just infuse this anyway? No, it doesn't matter because we're using. Oh, nice. Okay, so now we're just completely blue. I'm feeling blue. <laughs> Not going to use Celestial Nighthawk, it just doesn't make sense. Um, but we can try to use some other form of exotics. I mean, these ones would be alright. You know what? Never mind. It's It would be okay. This is for Cade. This is for you, alright? This is for Nathan Fillion. Out there... All right, which way are we going? This way? Yeah. What is this giant diced thing? Can I inspect this? Yeah. This crystal doesn't match anything in the city's geological database. It wouldn't. You'll see. Okay. I think it's starting... The We still don't know why. We still don't know why he's coming over here. We still don't know where what any of these are, so... Oh, crap. 
Throw. I hate throw. Especially the taken ones. Okay, I think we're safe. Is there anything on this side that we can interact with? Oh look, there's some jumping puzzles over there. Maybe that's where we need to go. Ah, crap. Sorry, I'm just trying to concentrate. I realise I'm a little bit quiet. There we go. Okay, I think we're good. Let's move on. Where the heck is this place? It looks pretty cool though. Oh. Oh boy. No! Oh, you son of a... I hate those things. That's like the first death we have and it's like... Oh, so, so undramatic. Are you serious? I got a sleeper shot lined up and it's just immune. I'm gonna kill you off from a from distance. I hate that guy. Where is he? Stupid thing. Free me, oh brother mine. No, 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 no! Something's wrong! It's almost like they're trying to... I don't know what they, what they mean by free. I'm guessing... Uh, right, my theory is that Aldrin's trying to revive his sister. I think, even in the most demented context, I'd say that's pretty reasonable guess, but it doesn't seem like it. It almost feels like he's trying to kill his sister. Oh, crap. Let's kill this guy as soon as possible. There we go. Okay, not bad. Uh, I would really like that heavy, but it's kind of really close to the portal. Is there any way for me to get it? Like hop in and then maybe slide through? Okay, that might work. Oh, dang it. Didn't work. Never mind. Okay, it, it kind of feels like we're just kind of going in circles. Oh, here we go. You've 
no idea how fortunate you are to be my chosen. You hold the flesh of a god in your hands. You are mere steps away from our salvation. Only light and dark together can unlock my way back into your world. That's it. Keep going. Free me! Wow, that was uh that was definitely unexpected. I'm slightly concerned that I've changed it to uh a gunslinger, but I'm not gonna change it back. It's it's about Cade. It's for Cade. The Does that mean he's actually dead? Voice of Riven. Is this is a giant servitor? Holy cow. Okay. I'm not sure how to fight this guy, and wow, that hurts. 2019, 2085 is actually not too bad. Damage is pretty good. Okay, something's happening. Right, so from. Okay, so that was a pretty darn big uh, tracking cannon. Tracking cannon? Tracking bullet, or whatever it's called. I'm way out in the open, I need to get out of here. Hey there, throwing my time. I think Aldrin's gonna be spat back out. I think. Let's try to make this our base. This will definitely work. Let's try and use a bit of sleeper here because I can get... I... Oh, I wasted that. I can't get it to go through the... Okay, that was immune. Oh dear. What manner of hell am I into now? Oh no! Are you serious? I can't even step off the bridge because it's uh, it's, it's like a, it damages you over time. Jesus, that flinch though, that's why no one uses ha that's why no one uses sniper rifle, that flinch is just ridiculous. Right. Take that off, take that away off you, thank you. Should be able to kill you off with the hand cannon, I'm trying to save the sleeper for the boss so I don't want to uh, I don't want to like use up all this stuff. Okay, 
I've got two shots left. Need to be very careful here. If I can get some uh, get some cover again, let's see what I can go this way. Okay, looking good. I don't know what that was, but it dropped a heavy, which is good. Let's reload and see whether there's another one of those. Yes, there is. Okay. Right, I need regular ammo as well, so this this particular section here seems pretty really good. Oh, heavy. Nice. Okay. Okay, so I think these are like actually like... Ah, crap. No, get me out of here. Holy crow. Uh, okay, that was really bad. I almost died there. Stand. I can't just dodge. I can't keep dodging. If I can get back to the other side. That's like, it's got a higher platform, it's got a shield I can properly use. Ooh, that was close. Really? Okay, this I can probably handle. Well, level 48, which is a extremely good time to tell me. Hey, you know what? You leveled up. Great! I'm getting shot at though. Do you have a solution for that rather than giving me a level? I'd rather have some ammo. Okay, I need some ammo. There may be some up here. Maybe. Right, let's reload everything. And then we'll get back out there. I think this this is gonna be it. This is gonna be it. Are you serious? Immune. Really? Again? Just stay here for a little bit, please. Oh, he's very angry, and I don't blame him. Right, there has to be one more of those eye things that's uh, producing a shield for him, so I just need to... Yeah, this is way too much. Wow. A 
it's a solo quest. This is pretty. This is pretty tough, but not absolutely unmanageable. Just need to find out where the other guy is. Okay. I don't have a good shot of him from here. I need to shoot him from the other side. Okay, so there are two, I think. This one here. Can get that now. There's another one back towards the back, I think. Good stuff. Yeah, and then there's one all the way towards the end. Somewhere. I can just about see the tether. There we go. Whoa! Objective complete. Excellent. Now will Aldrin be spat out? That's my that's my next question. I didn't use my super because I I'm kind of guessing there may be a next fight, but I don't know. Congratulations. You have my undivided attention. Now where's my sister? She's not So this is to be a reckoning. Wait, not like this. Look at him. He's finished. Even with everything he's done, we can't just You have no idea what he's done. If Cade was here. I know what he would do, Guardian. Do you? Yes. What would the notorious Cade Six do? You have his gun. Seems you get the last word. <coughs> Everything I did, I did for her. <laughs> Funny. The line between light and dark is so very thin. Do you know which side you're on? Okay, do apologize for that final bit of blip there. The recording software just suddenly stopped and then re-recorded again. So I suspect I actually missed maybe two seconds of footage. Um, but I don't think that's going to impact too much. Uh, it is a bit of a shame, but um, that, then again, there's nothing more I can do. Now, back to the story. What what do you think? Do you think our guardian actually took the shot? What would you have done? Before before we actually get to see the ending, I don't know. Uh, but I probably wouldn't have shot him. I think Kate has a very good sense of what's good and what's bad. And he has his own... W w way of expressing it.
Oh, we're back in the tower, as it, sa it sounds like. So I'm hearing another verse. It could be the tower. So let's go. Let's let's see what we get right here, right now. So a new mission available. Let's let let's just open the destinations first and see what we have. Return to Ikora in the tower and return to Zavala in the tower. Okay, so there'll be a lot of stuff that we can work on. Let's have a look. So we've got all 490 auto rifle, nice. Uh, might as well equip it. New tasks must be submitted through the proper channel. Uh, what else is there? That's pretty much it. There isn't. There isn't actually anything here. Uh, okay, so I need to return to Banshee. Now let's check. Let's check the lost items and see whether I actually forgotten anything. So I'll take that. 43, I don't need that. 490, I'll take that, thank you. 488, that's not bad. Let's go talk to Zavala, then we'll go talk to Ikora. Do not think for a moment that I shed a tear over Aldrin's death. In another life, I would have killed him myself. But we are guardians. One life is nothing when weighed against the lives of an entire people on the very precipice of extinction. When you pursue vengeance into a foreign dominion, you put all of those lives at risk. The death of Aldrin Sav will have its consequences. Maybe not today, maybe not tomorrow, but the day will come. I hope we will survive it. Okay, so Savala is saying that yay, you got your revenge, but no, that's not very good for our people. Okay, so make up your mind, man. <laughs> I think it's, um, I think it's good, um, that we get a very clear answer now to say that Aldrin is actually dead, so we did shoot him. Um, but at the same time, I, I don't think I would have. I, I probably would have just, um, asked him to get back into the cell because he's clearly demented. At the end, uh, he didn't even get to see his sister, so there's not really anything that's, um, there's, he's just as, uh, big a victim, if you know what I mean. Um, Kate's death is just, like, a really bad, uh, side effect that came from something that's ultimately unfixable. So, but I don't think he really deserved to die. Um, so here we go. Let's talk to Akora. I realized the other day, Cade may have been my healthiest relationship. My hidden agents I must keep at a distance. Zavala and I rarely see eye to eye anymore. My ghost and I, it's complicated. And Osiris, you know that story. As for you, I have only ever been a supporting character in your story, but Kate was just my friend, my ridiculous, funny, constant friend. If we don't fight for our friends, what are we fighting for? What I'm trying to say is, I'm proud of you. And Thank you. Nice. Okay, so um, Ikora is definitely on more on Kate's side. Like she, she misses him. She, she's she was once part of Fire Team, so was Savala. But so I had no idea that her relationship with Savala had been kind of like um, that so cold. Um, I just thought that. They don't really need to talk to each other anymore. But anyway, here's the cloak. Let's have a look. Memory of Cade cloak. Oh, dang. It even has CYD6 at the nice and 777. I like this. I am using this cloak straight away. 
Paragon. So what else is actually is insulation reduces class ability cooldown each time you pick up an orb of light. Heavy ammo finder. <sighs> awesome. Okay. I am definitely going to wear this. What's this? Tier 1 Arc Damage Resist. Ooh, okay. Right. New milestone added. So what do we return to Petra on Tangled Shore? So no doubt there's more missions available. More stuff. Um I can't wait. <laughs> Let's equip this. Cade's cloak. Well, Kate in memory of Cade. This is Kate's cloak. I'm gonna be rocking this. This is actually the first cloak I liked. Indeed. I mean I there are some really interesting cloak, but none of them really quite tickled my fancy. This is the first one that seems alright. Nice. Okay, so uh what else? Let's go talk to Banshee. That's the one final step in the quest. And um after that this will be this would definitely be the end of the video. I would also like to like make some additional new videos but I don't really know what else is out there so it's kind of difficult but Banshee hopefully will give us the gun that I've been looking forward to since they announced that it will be coming back into D2. You did it. Ace is yours now. I'm glad. Cade would be glad too. But Ace... Oof. Ace is in rough shape. Ain't seen this kind of corrosion since, since, can't remember. Anyhow, Cade would have kept spare parts in his own personal loot stashes. Yours too now by rights. Drag him down, bring me the parts. We'll get this piece burned again. Okay, so it's not quite there yet. <laughs> I'm a little bit disappointed. Anyway. That's not, it's not exactly a bad thing, I guess, um, but still, I really would have loved to see the actual gun in action. So what do we need to do? Get five invasion kills with a hand cannon and gambit to collect the, oh, you serious? <laughs> Alright, well, in that case, it's about time uh, to say goodbye. And uh, thank you very much for watching and supporting the channel. If you've been watching from like start to finish, I uh, I don't know what to say to you. Thank you. Um, you you that it means a lot to me. Uh, it really does. So hopefully next time we see each other, I, my character will look less like a fashion crisis, and I will be able to do maybe a review on the Ace of Spades when I do finally get it. So. With that being said, thank you very much and uh, take it easy.